Hey everyone, welcome back to Judo Highlights. It's that time again, World Championship time, day one. So like, subscribe, and there'll be plenty of more videos uh, coming each and every day of the competition. So starting off with a huge upset against Koga Genki, with the Israeli judoka Koga Laev. So great Ippon for him. Round two, Koga's out. And then I've included another upset, Nagayama. Not an Ippon, it was Ari. But nonetheless, to get a Wazari on Nagayama is pretty outstanding. And to go through and beat him, well, that's outstanding as well. All right, moving on to some Ippons now. Nice Sumigaishi, I guess. Good control on the way over. And yeah, nice Uchimata by Krasaniki. And the Japanese, they turned out, or the women's Japanese team, they, they turned out with some great Newaza. And... Uh, it's an all-female final, and I'll do a video on that once the final's done. I'm making this video before the finals, actually, you know. You never know if there's going to be an Ippon or not. And it's late here in Japan, so I'm going to publish this one and get to bed. And in the morning, I'll make some videos on the finalists. Anyway, the Mongolian here, Osoto Gaishi. Beautiful counter. I think he actually did it twice during the day. He got two counters anyway. And here's Gary Goss. And watch this epic pass, how he gets out uh, of the legs there. Very well done. And then a great hold down by Gary Goss. I was picking him to uh, take gold after Nagayama was eliminated, but uh, Gary Goss himself didn't make it through. Left us right here. Hand around the back. Kind of an odd grip, to be honest. Kind of low around the stomach but yeah just not a good grip by blue gets counted and here is koga uh, on the female team and just a really nice combination kosoto osoto beautiful work there she's definitely someone to watch here we go a lovely counter here sorry this is the counter by the mongolian kosoto or is it a tani otoshi i have to have another look so yeah, just the angle here goes in for a seonage. And then, I mean, it looks like a Tani Otoshi. It's kind of somewhere between a, a Kosoto Gake and a Tani Otoshi. So who knows? Let me know in the comments, guys. And a nice Sumigaishi here. Ends up being an Ippon, actually. And then Gary Goss again showing us his excellent Newaza. And he's got that arm under his armpit. And that is not a place you want your arm. So yeah, to come back from Wazari down, great work. Drop down for a Seonage and then also the Otoshi. Beautiful work by the Kazakhstani. Another Osoto Otoshi here. Everyone wants to be on a Shohei, so many Osotos. Here's another one, look at this. Everyone is starting to realize that Osoto is a really, really effective technique. And here we have a counter. Harai Mokitomi by the Ukrainian. The beginning of a counter, I guess. And a kind of a weird drop down Seoinage. Stands up, goes into a Kochi. But I didn't like it. it. Wasn't the most beautiful looking technique. And the Korean Lee taking two stabs at a Seoinage. Is it a Tani Otoshi or is it a Kosoto Gake? What is it? Or is it just a Kosoto? Who knows? Alright guys, and uh, the next three Ippons are just Newaza from the females. So a nice armbar there. A Sunoda. And this is going to be a choke. Just really good control here. Turns it into an armbar. Rolling in the right direction. Sorry, I said it was going to be a choke, but it's going to be an armbar. Just total control all the way through. So the Japanese women, they have really good nyawaza. Goes in for a sumigaishi. Sunor, sunoda again. And come on, that, that's weak by blue, just to let him pull you up by, like that. But on the arm again. 
So Suno, they're looking really good. She might take gold, and we'll see in a couple of hours. All right, guys, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys soon.